We are going to Hualgusi, which is a census town in Assam. It is situated on the north bank of the river Brahmaputra, about 35 kilometers from Guwahati. It has the largest number of cottage industries engaged in handloom, for which it is also known as the Manchester of Assam. Muga silk, Pat silk along with Eri silk and Endi cloth from this region is famous for its quality. Meklasadors and gamuchas made from the indigenous materials is in demand throughout Assam as well as other parts of India. Hualkusi was made an important center of silk weaving. The handloom industry of Hualkusi encompasses cotton textile, silk textile as well as khadi cloth which are in fact traditional cloth endowing high social and moral value in and outside the state. However, Hualkusi is well known for silk textiles both mulberry and muga silk. In fact, muga, the golden fiber, is produced only in Assam and it has also tremendous export potentiality. Such activities are intimately linked with the culture and tradition of the Assamese people since long past. Pat silk is produced by Bombix Dexter silkworms which feed on mulberry leaves. It is usually brilliant white or off-white in color. Its cloth can dry in shadow. Airy silk is made by Samia Cynthia Ricini, which feed on leaves of castor oil plant. It is also known as Endi or Erandi silk because manufacturing process of Airy allows the pupa to develop into adults and only the open-ended cocoons are used for turning into silk. These are the eggs. If the area in which the eggs are laid is continually warm, the eggs will hatch about 10 days after the moth laid them. From within the egg, a tiny silkworm emerges. The caterpillar is covered in black hair and goes to munching on the mulberry leaves as soon as it leaves the egg. The silkworms shed their skin up to four times or more as they continue to eat and grow. Inside the cocoon, the silkworm changes into a pupa the stage between larva and adult moths. After round two weeks, the pupa emerges from the cocoon as an adult moth. The silk used by humans comes from the domesticated silkworm, Bombex mori. When a silkworm has eaten enough, it constructs a cocoon made out of silk fibers and inside that cocoon it turns into a pupa. After many days, a fully formed adult silkworm moth emerges through a skip-soaked opening in the bottom of the cocoon. Muga silk is one of the many nature's gift to Assam. The speciality of this silk is its golden bright color. Muga is derived from the Assamese word Muga meaning yellowish. It is superior in every respect from the normal white silk available all over the world. Muga silk is supposed to be one of the costliest fabrics in the whole world. Muga is produced from the cocoons of Anthere Assamensis, which is available only in Assam. Muga worm, Muga polu, which is called in Assamese, also has the same life cycle as silk worm, that is, from egg to caterpillar, pupa, and finally the moth. After the final skin change, Straw frames are provided in which silkworms make its cocoon. Cocoon making takes further 8 days. Man interferes this life cycle at the cocoon stage to obtain the silk, a continuous filament of commercial importance used in weaving silk, the dream fabric. One can continuously hear the rhythmic click clack of the traditional throw shuttle room. Hence we come to know that for a large number of cottage handloom industries popularly known as Manchester of Assam, Hualkusi is one of the world's largest weaving villages where the entire population is engaged in weaving silk fabrics. A renowned center of silk production, particularly known for Muga, the golden silk of Assam which is not produced anywhere else in the world. 
weaving is not just a tradition handed down by generations but a way of life and a labor of love